kani kujifunza data science kwa kutumia Python programming language utengeneza simple web application kufanya analytics kwenye video hii tutatengeneza simple web application ku add data kwenye file excel okay so na file excel ile hapa ambapo current nina items tatu ni vessel ni vya pamoja na cost so kutumia web interface kama inavyoonekana hapa yenye form ya python upande wa kushoto so ni click add new record hiyo record itakuja kwenye ili file excel hii inatumika pale ambapo uh, file la excel linakuwa accessed na multiple users kwenye environment ya network so endapo file hili inakuwa accessed na user zaidi ya mmoja kuna kuwa hakuna namna isipokuwa kutengeneza uh, web interface na hasa wa kutumia uh, streamlit library ambayo ni open source library ya python kwa ajili ya data science hasa ni library kwa ajili ya data so sio tu ku add data kwenye hilo file excel lakini pia kufanya simple analytics kwa ku visualize data kwenye data frame kwa kutumia simple data frame au kwa kutumia cross tabular cross tabulation okay so for example now current in items tatu na product tatu ya kwanza ni nivea soap ni vea moja na coste okay so na aspect yao ni ku add new item huku ni click add new item item itakuwa saved kwenye file excel okay Okay, so to add a new item. Okay, so ntakuja katika hii web interface. Kisha nita add a new item. For example, new item is data. Then uh, type is new. Okay, and hii ni just a so. Okay, then product ID ni auto. Auto generate. Product ID is auto generate. Date registered is auto. Automatic current date. Purchasing price, for example, is 1000. Okay, and selling price is 2. When you click here, add a new record. So record you have to file Excel. Okay. So click add a new record. So new record has been added. You know, our product name ni Deto. Okay. And it is new name is purchasing price one thousand. Same price two thousand. Expected profit in one thousand. So now you have to ni automatic. Me add a new automatic. Okay. Okay. So now we ni currency analytics. So summation ya purchasing price of course purchasing price ni hii hapa so ukijumlisha zote unapata hii hapa summation just just kuja kuji refresh nikirefresh utaona hiyo summation hapo so summation ya all purchasing price all purchasing price selling price selling price ni hapa summation na expected profit summation okay so now we'll spin na close tabulation ambayo ni hii ambayo inaonekana roshi ni pamoja new used ipo zero all in one Assume new new zero used in new. in cross tabulation of course so nikija katika file excel hizo data ambazo nime add sasa hivi zitaonekana ambao ni data kwenye file excel tutaziona kwenye data kwenye file excel okay so now kwenye file excel so now ukuta data imekuwa added here kwa new then its categories so and so on so huku pia naweza nika add a new item kupitia hiyo kwenye file excel moja kwa moja kisha hiyo item itakuja kuonekana hapa okay so for example na add new item and for example for core okay then this is new okay then category for example is so then serial number for example one one uh, two two okay then date added for example then this one okay and for example purchasing price is one thousand and sale price is uh, two thousand and profit is no, 1000 for example so when you click save save we file okay after saving you can close so you can refresh and just refresh okay so you can click your records so now we can call it already so new and this is date okay so you can click add a new product your product is under the file excel so uh, you can click name for example name for example is as familiar Okay, then it's new, it's in perfume, okay, and uh, date registered, purchase price, for example, 2000, sale price, for example, is 4000. Okay, when you click add a new record, so new record has been added, but he, and profit in the quality automatic, uh, selling price in the summation, you can measure the paper trap, so I'm going to get a close tabulation, so you can get an easy app, and it will share in perfume, but we are so, okay. So nikija katika file Excel. Hiyo ta product yetu ni Camellia New Perfume, okay? So here hapo. Data hizi hapo zimeonekana katika file Excel, okay? 
So hii ni njia mbako mbani efficiency ya ku just add a uh, record kwenye file la Excel kupitia form ya Python. Anakamia file hilo lina kuwa accessed na multiple users kwenye za hii uh, simple analytics dashboard hili ya ku add data na ku visualize data kwenye our data frame our cross tabula. Ok, so now unuto kwa jivisa sikuna hapa kuma data tumezifanya validation, add new record, so product name is required. Ok, so unuto validation ni kusa product name uje jasa. So source code is on your link description, you just download it, uh, source code, ok. So how to implement, uh, just show how to implement. Ok, so wajwa nye desktop, uh, desktop ambo ni hapa. Wajwa kwenye desktop hapa, yes, right click, new new folder then just create add uh, data tutorial ok add data tutorial this folder name na tiweza kwenye, kwenye desktop ok so I just double click kwa jivia kuli open ok so kisha fungua uh, visual studio code na access visual studio code uh, visual studio code uh, shakwa open then just come to click here file menu and you click here open folder ok so navigate uh, desktop and uh, uh, directory add data tutorial and I click to select and click select folder ok itakuwa kwa hapo so hapa kisha na ujo click here icon yako new file send file name is main sorry m capital h main dot and nandika file extension main dot py kisha na kiki enter ok ok so after then wajia ku run first wajia ku chika terminal new terminal ok kwenye visual studio code hapa na wajia ku run file langu hili nandika stream rate stream then rate ok then run run my file on it on main dot py space n capital rates are being dot define extension then click enter to execute then it's a learning on your web browser ok ok so file language ya ku limisha run ili hapa special steam rates kuji kuna hii made with steam rates ok and side navigation kili kili kutawana hizi just kwa jiri ya ku kwa jiri ya kufanya settings mbali mbali so now hakuna chochote ok so after then Kwa kwa ndika kodi from the scratch. Kwa kodi nisha ziandika hizi hapa. So just come to copy kwenye source code. Kama wato kwa mzidownload source code. Import streamlight. Okay, so just copy it. Then come to paste. Import streamlight as st. So hapa manaka yinina import streamlight library. Okay. So kama wato install streamlight. Utakuja kwenye desktop start button. Tandika cmd. Kwa jika ku install streamlight. Then tandika just a p install install stream stream light sorry namna hii kama wajia install kisha wata click enter kwa jia kufanya installation ya stream light ok so kwa kwa jia mimi nimisha install so sana wajia kuinstall tena ok so weo utarani yo command wajia kuinstall lakini hili people yezo kufanya kazi install python kwanza haikisha mi install python kuinstall python utakuja suguja utakuja google as uh, for example google.com then you have to andika download python python download so utakujia ku download python utakujia ku click link ya kwanza kisha uta download python uta click ya pa download python ukisha download python kwenye windows 10 uta install ukisha install ndo utakujia ku andika yu command ya po wada kufungua command prompt ndo uta andika yu pip install pip install a stream stream rate oh sorry ndo itafanya kazi so itafanya kazi hii itapu misha install nini python ok so now tunandelea project yetu ni ya pipe point so nita import stream rate of course ndo misha install tayari kule misha install bus yu library itapu janda kwa save di kwenye computer kwenye kwa disk c janda kwa save di so mi ya wanta import lakini ita yasani kwenye ust ok hapu nikia ust na import na panda, na import na random number, na import na date and time na import na, from date and time to import date, nita import date and time ok, so just na copy zote hizi just copy zote, 
kisha mwenye kwa paste hapa for example so nime import nini the stream rate panda import pandas as pd import random to generate a random number import date from date and time and import date and time okay again copy let's copy okay okay so now st mbon hii st our stream rate okay dot set page config page config page title is dashboard then a page icon no icon none layout is wide initial sidebar set is outro and then st dot markdown is just like a break all space then when you save changes come to my page and refresh okay so you can see me badilika hapa mekua dashboard na hapa bas current bado wamuna chochote okay so now come to copy or here hapa just copy it and come to duplicate hapa and come to paste paste it okay so today date today date inafanya kazi ya kuadd date kwenye file letu la kwenye 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 date inafanya kazi ya kuadd current date kwenye ile product product na kuadd na date ile kuadd ni lilini so ita, ita capture current date ndio hii so current year was ni make a comment we are to it to me generate random number kwa ajili ya serial number of products okay from 0 to 10 hiyo hapo okay so generate random number na hizo numbers zitakuwa ni just integer so random number is a variable equal to random is the built in function dot random integer from 0 to 10 kama nakana kwa okay 0 to 10 okay <coughs> so now na read data okay so load the excel file so now come to copy and come to duplicate load the excel file df uh, user defined variable equal to pd okay dot read excel read excel built in function kwa njia ku load data my file name is data dot xls okay Okay, so you know finally, uh, just come to to desktop. Okay, so when you desktop, for for data. Okay, so now na uh, copy, just copy. Okay, you when you add the data tutorial our project, our project directory, then paste. Okay, here. Okay, so now open it. Okay, so now na data this is a uh, uh, previous video amba nilikuonyesha so hizi data just na zidelete so kwa jili ya kuwacha empty so delete so as you see kwa mba uh, my data workbook now is empty ya mna chochote na just call on product name category so make sure that unafata uh, variable naming rules product, uh, variable variable jina variable ya taki kuwa na underscore kustart na underscore wala kustati na special character wala ita contain space hiyo ndo kanuni ya variable name na wezi kutumia special word au ze uh, reserved word kama user defined so fata kanuni za kudefined variable ndo inafaa zaidi kutengenezi hizi uh, headings kujiu ok ok so now <coughs> hapa ndole huli load ilo file ok so lead excel data dot file extension dot x l o s x sheet name is sheet number one okay so now current you can see sheet number one ni hii hapa okay so kama nam angalia jina la sheet na kisha ndika sheet name okay and after so so nazo kuja ku print my data set okay so nukwa ndika um st dot data frame as well okay so this is good function data frame then print data frame okay and let's put use container width okay equal to to save changes and come to run my project okay now you can see now my data set is now empty no value inside so look at to me a form sasa yeah python okay insert data zina ingia katika lo file excel okay na kujia kwa ngila huku tuzione okay <coughs> okay so kwa jili ya kupunguza kwa epuka ku kwa jili ya time just to just tengeneza yu uh, analytics 
just copy it is called is what is in the form copy it and it comes to duplicate so he just delete so we just going to to that is it okay okay so now this is the form a still not study bad with hider add a new product it will open the shot options form a still not study bad form option form okay the first input field is the product name equal to options form dot text input name product type can be new or used in later when you drop down menu okay category can be uh is select box type and so perfume lotion other you just is a one drop down menu for your selecting serial number of product is auto number generate that is product ID value random number and Ninan editable so this able equal to true date equal to current date today date and today date in variable on here today date to create your okay disabled is true take you edit you purchasing price equal to form dot number input purchasing price and selling price and this is add button is add button okay <coughs> okay so now when you come to of course uh when you come to save changes now and i refresh okay so uh it's t dot t okay so save changes and come to refresh and outputs okay so now i will put that uh here home. so product name uh, use the or not use the or perfume lotion okay product id is auto increment and purchasing price and add a new record so when you click add a new uh, so no action no action okay so now to test to work event here event click okay so now uh let's set in the event to set the event when button is click the like when you add data and then you come to copy and button is clicked okay and come to duplicate so <coughs> you have to paste when button is clicked if add data i'm going to button here too is if product name is not empty we will find a validation data frame equal to b dot concatenation data frame dot pd dot data frame from records product name column on the product name and uh, Product type category serial number, okay. Imposing type category and serial number, and uh, purchasing price, selling price, and expected profit. So it's on the column. See, you can do those means and decap. Means and dictionary, okay. To me, they are signing a variable multiple you product name, product type, category, serial number. I'm both on easy upper variables. It was a popular show to easy. To me, they are signing, okay. So, DF to two the data frame dot to excel to append to append the data to add a new record to add a new record on our file our file is data dot excel xx index equal to false else product name is required if i'm going to indicate our product name okay so now we need to print an output show records so show records and copy it and come to duplicate new york show record Okay, with with the stx dot expander records show data and kujia you know, show data and here kujia you know, kujia cross tabulation cross tabulation to me find cross tabulation here product category okay product category now type category type okay so now save changes and come to refresh okay so now we can see records is empty cross tab also is empty so let's try to add a new record for example is a camellia yes right here camellia okay so is used the okay and ocean and purchasing price is one thousand okay and selling price is two thousand okay let's try add a new record this is permissions denied okay okay current uh, data here to work book we may open so close 
Okay, unatoka we close hiyo ndio utakuja ku add. Add new record. So new record has been added hapo ni hii hapo. Okay. So add another record for example date and Okay. So umeona ile ile ambayo ilitokea pale inaweza kuifanyia exception muda si mrefu. Purchasing price and sale price and this is a uh, so okay then add a new record so you can see that we go already okay when you generate cross tab we can use a lotion for general soap so sasa hivi nataka nitengeneze a lotion soap and now perfume so perfume tako already kwenye cross tab okay so this perfume is for example romance okay and this is a new product and this is perfume add a new record you can see now perfume okay na huko umekwa already romance okay so okay so the thing that i'm about to find up on you for no nick you open for your excel my data excel data so we we'll see my product is camellia daytona romance okay so it's just need to expand it through as nice show it is okay isn't it okay so come on you wanna you need it now this product is your number is okay and so on and so on <coughs> So tunataka tu just kuweka environment. Unaona nikiclick add new record. Kuna era. Kwa nini kwa sababu current ni meli open au uzi kwa pet data kipindi ni meli open. So tunataka tu fanye exception handling hapa. Ah. Uh, Yazani exception imeanza kutokea hapa. Okay. So just cut is this is just right try and just paste. It. Okay and this will be catch okay au tunatumia catch kwenye programming language kama vile java inatumika catch kwa ajili ya ku throw exceptions okay so kwenye python tunatumia except except then uh just write st stream write dot of course dot warning as well stream write warning please uh also uh, please close Close your data set. Please close your data set. Unable, unable to write. Unable to write. Okay. So same changes. And come to uh refreshing. I just refresh it. Okay. So then, for example, product name is uh for example again cocoa and currently uh, excel workbook shop open d so when you click add record okay and able to write please close your data set okay when you close my data set when you click add this record a new record has been added when you click here so you can see cocoa okay mm. so, Sasa so, hii data imeingia tumeingiza kwa ajili ya kutestia eh kwa hiyo kutestia so now to delete so key delete huko except changes una ni delete na ni key refresh utaiona kwa so ni refresh okay high point okay so is good so now add new record the product name is required okay so this is validation error when you enter product name blah 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 blah, blah. And the current Excel book is opened, so I click here the new record. And able to write, please close the data set. So until you close the data set, it has a point set that, okay? So now, to the area. Oh, just come to copy. Okay, so <coughs> copy this simple analytics. This is the top analytics, okay? So just copy it and uh, come to main. Okay, so now before before okay hapa so hii ni top analytics as well na hii ni function vitengeneza uh definition ya function ni function to analytics and built in sorry user defined so kumbuka mambo ya indent eh oh, indent hapo unaona hapa hii imeingia ndani kidogo haja kai hivi italeta error so unaona inaingia ndani kwa sababu ya function hii ni kama brackets fulani eh purchasing price equal to float my data frame summation of purchasing price and this summation of selling price selling price then summation of profit so not only was the visualize okay okay so you can scope it and for three columns as well okay 
Okay, let's copy and here come to pasting. Okay, so now it's good. So <coughs> I have a column one, column two, and column three. Of course, there are three columns there. Okay? Uh, three columns, three columns, and these small columns. When you column one, st.info purchasing price icon here. st.metric label is Tanzanian shillings, can be USD or N. Value, the purchasing price, in your year format monetary. Okay, column two information is column three profit from the print purchasing price you see that mark down in horizontal line okay yes horizontal line so we come to refresh and save changes and refresh the page okay so now uh as at the call function here tonight to analytics somebody so uh let's come to call our function here yes analytics here Analytics on in save changes, okay. So come to refresh, okay. <coughs> so now you can see our simple analytics. So purchasing price need 3000, okay. Because the count is dropped and 3000 query, selling price need 6000, doesn't easy. So selling price could the count is the uh, 6000, expected profit 3000 because county. Okay, and I come to cost tabulation. Okay, so you can see our category of shen, perfume, and the soap. So, when a perfume product is acquired, other so you click other, for example, is um, okay, okay, so now this is used the product and a new product, and this is uh, other okay, and purchasing price is uh, 3000. Selling price is five thousand. When I click add a new record, so when you call stop on other, I make added here. Other news one, news this one, then zero. Okay, so now. So, okay, you may unable to write a data set. Please close. Uh, you may add data. You just need to close. Add you may add data. I can you may later error. So you will have to make sure you uh, sorry, yeah, yeah, okay. So now, <coughs> close data set first. Okay, let's save it. Okay, come to refresh. Okay, so on, on, uh, I, I save, I could save, eh? I could save. Call. Yes, um, yes, 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 okay. So this is new, and this is other, other, okay, and this is a three thousand. I mean, how thousand? Okay, so now add a new record. New record has been added. Now, to any other, the salter can refresh that may retain. Maybe I will review the apple cross tabulation. Uh, okay, other here, apple. Okay, now who will be ready? Maybe I will carry Okay, so now we need to work on the kitchen shabari charge tomorrow. So, the shabari charge tomorrow. Takuja to copy the code yapa. So just copy it. Ndakuja kwenye file ilangu ili. Tatengeneza new file. Tatengeneza template dot py. Okay. Kisha nita click enter. Then enter paste. Okay. Nanda ku paste import st stream writer st. This is my function. My function ito wa ui. My function. It's still to mark down who would only make a code is a HTML. So it's in the HTML code. Uh, HTML code, of course, in the bootstrap uh, CDN. This is a bootstrap CDN, bootstrap link. This is a container fluid. This is a div class card. This is a class uh, H uh, heading 3. This text is secondary HTML. So HTML. Again, in a quantum, in Simulate dot markdown. He don't know how square code is HTML. Eh? Okay, so I'm going format expand the corner font size. Kuba. Okay, now we should have a and see if allow HTML equal to true. So he now they could call if I language in the template dot py. They eh? could call when you mean so from 
from our template from my template file then import everything in my gonna make a star okay so after a student markdown happen and I just click on the function under UI here with Iona and you click in the function here when we call you guys I'm born here for me define here okay UI okay so I think now only for your position I could uh, save changes okay so, add the data to Excel file data visualization so not gonna break uh, so the break let's copy it that's the turn put a break put your running break okay save changes and come to refresh okay so i can see any break email function so now click uh, study navigation click in settings edit theme theme we can to so clicking it uh records all right this one that's on the canopy easy so now you can change settings and edit theme primary color you can choose any any color for example Let's choose here again. Okay. Tone has me change cool, yeah? And uh, background. Has been changed. Text color. Put it right. Has been changed there. Yeah? And um, side nav. And see side nav is this one. Has been changed, okay. And just okay. And copy, copy theme to clipboard, and then copy, then close. Okay. So now our theme in a look nice. You know, can I'm in close tab. I'm like, so this is our theme. Okay. Okay. So come to our project. <coughs> Click it, create a new folder create a new directory dot answer a dot then this stream right then you click enter a directory inside is a directory to a new file for new directory then file will be config dot t m l o t o m l o click enter then you paste paste is on both to this copy file then save changes okay so now you need to refresh now my page in order to when you go about to the run so I'm come to run so on terminal you can now click it to terminal new terminal okay okay so now I happen to just a stream right run main dot py okay then you click enter I want to go to the run here I'm going to run I'm going to stop it now we use a control okay so now I'm going to apply Nine and look nice, okay. So when you expand it, oh, okay, okay, and look nice. Okay. So, so I'm going to go here. I'm going to stop it. Control C, and Control C, of course. Um, Control C, or just another kind of close it by if you do, okay. So, in a look nice now, our project in a look nice, okay. So, name, use key, and so on. So he's in the records, okay. I'm on his. Make close selling price. Oh, in the potter expected the profit. Now I'm gonna just come on a free to fly, maybe. Okay. Packers in Asia. Yeah. I'm not keep. To come here, you may not be like it, right? So I'm gonna type on Asia. Type category. So I'm gonna type the category to get like, okay. Then serial number and date already. So I can use two. Okay. All. So I display all. All is the word display. Okay. Close tab. Yeah. Okay. So I have only add a new record. You can add a new record. Product name is required. You can use it. Okay. Okay. So now thank you for just for the video tutorial. Just click. When you could like your for comment, you could share and subscribe my channel. <coughs> and then we enjoy it as we are ended up watch the video Zadi Busana stream rate uh web application. <coughs>